Okay, so in this video, we're going to be taking a look at how we can set up our account on Oxford Abstracts and view an online conference. So there's a couple of ways we can get to the conference. We can either from our dashboard for the event, click on view next to the program, and this is gonna take us to the virtual conference. Or we can get the link from the administrator for the event, and this will take us to the same place. So if I follow this link, we'll see that we get taken to virtual.oxfordabstracts.com. And then we're taken to the actual virtual conference itself. So here I can see the program, or at least the outline of the program, because you'll see here in the top right that I'm not signed in yet. So if the public program is enabled, you'll be able to navigate parts of the program, but you won't be able to see it in full detail. So if I then go to sign in, I just need to put in my account details. And then I'll sign in. So from here, it's going to ask me a few questions about uh, setting, basically setting up your account for the conference. So if we hit next, it's going to ask us for our time zone. So this is good because it will show us the times of the event for the different sessions and so on in our particular time zone. So pick a time zone and then hit next. And then we're given a page where we can create our name badge. So it's going to fill in your first and last name in for you because it, we know this from when you logged in. But you can change this to have a different name on your name badge for the event. So you can do lots of things. You can upload a picture, uh, give yourself a role or an affiliation. So we can see as we fill in the name badge, we can start to see it here on the right hand side. Some other things we can add are the, the administrator may have put in some interests and you can choose any of these interests and put them onto your badge. Next up, you can decide or you can say rather if you would like to enable the chat feature. So if you turn this off, you won't be able to chat with other people and other people won't be able to chat with you. And you can also choose whether you show your online availability. So this little green indicator shows other people that you're online, but you can turn this off as well. Then we can also link to different social media. So we've so we start off, we can add in our email address. And so this then adds the email icon here so people can email you directly. And then you can choose to add in any of these different um, links for your accounts. So for Instagram, I can put in my Instagram handle here, and now the Instagram icon shows up on the, on the uh, preview. So once we're happy with that, we'll just hit next again, and then we're finished. So now I can see that I'm signed in and I've got access to all the chat features and functionality and I can see the full program and I can click through into any of the sessions and also any of the submissions. So I can see the full detail now. Okay, thanks for watching this uh, short video on how to set up your account for an online conference with Oxford Abstracts. Okay, thank you.